Do you ever feel crappy sometimes and you just can't put your finger on what it is? When things get busy or we have other people that we're taking care of, we can tend to not put ourselves first or our self-care first. So it's a new year. That can be changed. Let's talk about it. The first element of self-care is taking care of your body and that can go from the inside out. So that might be exercise or eating well. I'm going to put up a quick list here. Check it out and it doesn't doesn't have to be extensive or excessive. It's really just about moving and whatever feels good and comfortable for you. Say you didn't want to totally revamp your diet just yet, but what's one small baby step that you could take? Like maybe cutting down on soda or adding in more vegetables into your diet. Next up is what's going on up here and that can be affected a couple of different ways. It could be internal like intrusive thoughts, excessive stress or worry or it could be external which means like exposing yourself to stressful situations like being in an unhealthy relationship or a high stress job. The third self-care aspect is spirituality and that can look different for many different people. It doesn't necessarily have to be religion but it's how are you tending to your soul so if you're going out and putting out good things into the world and kindness you're gonna see that reflected back to you the opposite is gonna show you the opposite that's one thing to think about when it comes to weighing your spirit another thing is investing in the things that are important to your spirituality whether that be prayer or meditation so let's say you're really busy and you're like I just don't have enough time in the day to do all three things you might think about combining them so activities like yoga and meditation you're hitting all three mind body and spirit at the same time i hope this gave you something to think about remember baby steps is progress so just making one small change and then ramping it up as you go along and you start to see the difference is gonna help you keep motivation you don't want to put in a whole bunch of really aggressive changes all at once because then it's going to feel overwhelming it's going to be hard to stick to i believe in you thank you for watching stop look and listen with samantha